Debbie McGee is on fire and as fierce as ever as she flashed her knickers on the Strictly Come Dancing tour. The former contestant is proving she's still got it as she kicks her leg above her head live on stage. The 59-year-old famously defied her years during her time on the BBC One show, and it looks like absolutely nothing has changed. Debbie, who was married to late magician Paul Daniels, is proving she can still light up the dance floor with her amazing moves. Coupled with professional partner Giovanni Panis, Debbie is strutting her stuff like there's no tomorrow. Dress in a gold tassel dress to match her fellow female stars. Debbie gives so much attitude and energy to her fierce performances, at least if these pictures are anything to go by. The snaps show what Debbie and the gang got up to when the tour called in at the Arena Birmingham, and it looks like it was one hell of a show. And Debbie looks proud as punch as she poses with her fellow contestants Alexandra Burke, Susan Kalman, Gemma Atkinson, and the show's professional ladies. During her time on the show, there were rumors of a romance between her and her 27-year-old partner Giovanni. But while there was nothing romantic going on, she did admit that they have a special chemistry. She said on Loose Women, We really do have a very special chemistry. He's really special to me and I'm sure I am to him. We love each other to bits but there was nothing more than a friendship and this amazing working partnership. We love dancing together and I think that's why people thought there was a romance because when you dance, it's very physical. Debbie was also asked by the panel what it was like having to be so up close and personal with another man after losing husband Paul. She said, I never really thought about it Gloria, because it was learning to dance so I didn't really think of it in that way, that I was up close with a strange person, because I didn't feel uncomfortable with Giovanni. From day one I felt comfortable with him so there wasn't anything that made me feel shy. One of those lifts, he had to put his hand between my legs and that's as close as you can get to a man. I can't explain why but we were just really comfortable in each other's company so I never felt anything that felt wrong so we just had a lovely time. She added, I'm really missing Giovanni because every morning you meet them, you don't have a day off and I'm really missing those laughs.